Hey everybody, it's Falco Dragon here. I am going to do a reaction video that was by request. And that was requested by Erica Meneses. Meneses? <laughs> Whatever, however it's pronounced. Uh, and I'm going to tag on to it one that I saw and I loaded up. It's been in my tabs waiting for a reaction for a while, but I didn't want to do it by itself. Uh, which is Hamilton performing the cabinet battle in the West Wing while they were at the White House. They might as well perform it, right? So I'm, I'm anxious to see that one. That should be fun. This, but I love burn, so I'm sure I'll love first burn. Wait, did she get burned? Was there a burn before the burn of the musical? I'm trying to think if she got burned by anything else. Maybe jealousy over Angelic? Said you were mine. I thought you were mine. Do you know what Angelica said when I told her what you'd done? She said, You have married an Icarus. He has flown too close to the sun. Don't take another step in my direction. I can't be trusted around you. I don't know who you are. I have so much to learn. I'm rereading your letters and watching them. Burn. Oh, I like it. I'm watching them. Burn. I can see what I'm talking about. You published the letters she wrote to you. You told the whole world how you brought this girl in. To our bed in clearing your name, you have ruined our lives. Heaven forbid someone whisper he's part of some scheme. Your enemy whispers, so you have to scream. I know Ooh. about whispers. I, I see like it. how you look at my sister. Okay, okay. Now I see what you mean. Um, yeah, that was uh, that was fire. Literally, no pun. No well, pun intended, I should say. But um, oh man, the uh, it was such a more fierce, you know, version. And it was it was good. I I could see just from a acting director kind of viewpoint. I could see where that would be like a song after she like reclaimed the the song the way it is in the musical is a very slow burn if that's the case it's that it, it fits the shock of being a jilted lover where she's just like she doesn't know what to say she doesn't know what to do and 
she's just learned that her husband had an affair as well as that he's published the affair to the world and there's that numbness and then eventually it builds till she and that calm that calm kind of huh so that's what you did hmm well i see and then she's just kind of burning the letters that is in a way kind of like more devastating than the the fire that, that fiery response that someone getting up in your face when you know you deserved it that's it's never fun but it's easier to take you're like yes take it out on me i know i deserve it because of why you're punishing yourself too and but when they're just sitting there quiet and you you want them to scream you want them to say something and they're just not and that disappointment is kind of like the mother quote you know i'm not mad i'm just disappointed well in this case she's both but um that disappointment hurts so much worse than the anger does and so i could see why they would lean towards that for the musical uh and it fits so well there just that pain and sadness and she's a mourning that that that's the key in the one in the musical it's a song of mourning and in this one it's a song of reclamation you know her reclaiming her own strength but she's not ready yet in the musical you know which i like um she she's saying no i'm gonna step back if you see my fire if you see my anger that's part of the narrative i'm not going to be part of your narrative and i i really like that for the play but i love the song on its own i mean hell if it wasn't for the very specific things about hamilton dialogue it could be a, a single today easily and so yeah i'm very happy that you showed that to me thank you and now i am going to load up the west wing and the only thing I know is it says, like I said, ham for ham, West, West Wing cabinet battle. And it says, Who, you think we'd leave the White House without a West Wing style? So, and the cabinet battle definitely fits well. So I'm anxious to see, just imagine, I'm just imagining them performing. I, I, well, I couldn't really bring Obama into this because then he'd be the president. Unless they taught him the lyrics and then he could do it. That would be funny. But, uh, so I'd love to see this kind of looks like a scene from the West Wing. I like that. The issue on the table, Secretary Hamilton's plan to assume state debt and establish a national bank. Secretary Jefferson, you have the floor, sir. Life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. We fought for these ideals. We shouldn't settle for less. These are wise words. Enterprising men, quote them. Don't act surprised, you guys, because I love them. But Hamilton forgets plan would have the government assume state's debt. Right. Now oh, place your bets as to who that benefits, the very seat of government where Hamilton sits. Not true. Ooh, if the shoe fits, wear it. If New York's in debt, why should Virginia bear it? Uh, our debts are paid. I'm afraid. He's trying so hard not to we got made in the shade. In Virginia, we plant seeds in the ground. We create. You just want to move our money around. This financial plan is an outrageous demand and it's too many damn pages for any man to understand. Stand with me in the lane <laughs> of the free. Pray to God we never see Hamilton's candidacy. Look, when Britain taxed our tea, we got frisky. Imagine what gonna happen when you try to tax all of this. Thank you, Secretary Jefferson. Secretary <laughs> Hamilton. Thomas. Your response. <laughs> Thomas, that late. was a real nice declaration. Welcome to the present. We're running a real nation. <laughs> Would you like to join us or stay mellow doing whatever the hell it is you do in Monticello? If we assume the debts, the union gets a new line of credit, a financial diuretic, how do you not get it? If we're aggressive and competitive, the union gets a boost. You'd rather give her the seven day a civics lesson from a slaver. Hey, neighbor, your debts are paid because you don't pay for labor. We plant seeds in the South. We create and keep planting. We know who's really doing the planting. Wow. And another thing, Mr. Age of Enlightenment, don't lecture me about the war. You didn't fight me. You think I'm frightened of you, man? We almost died in the trench while you were off getting high with the French. As Thomas Jefferson always has a thing with the president, reticent. There is a plan to have jettison. Madison, you mad as a Madison. Take your medicine. Damn, you're a worse shape than the national deficit. Sitting there useless as two shits. Hey, turn around, bend over. I'll show you where my shoe is. Excuse me, excuse me. Excuse me, Madison. Jefferson, take a walk. Hamilton, take a walk. We can lean after a brief recess. Hamilton, a word? I wonder if they... 
You don't have the votes. <laughs> You're going to need congressional <laughs> approval, and you don't have the votes. Such a blunder. Sometimes it makes me wonder why I even bring the thunder. Why he even brings the thunder. <laughs> a little hype, man. I'm sorry, these Virginians are birds of a feather, oh, man. I'm from Virginia, so watch your mouth. So we let Congress get held hostage by the South. You need the votes. No, we need bold strokes. We need this No, plan. you need to convince more folks. Well, James Madison won't talk to me. That's a non-starter. Ah, winning was easy, young man. Governing's hard. They're being in transit. You have to find a compromise. But they don't have a plan. They just hate money. Convince them of the what happens if I don't get congressional approval? I imagine they'll call for your removal. Sir, figure it out, Alexander. That's an order from your commander. Yes, sir. Oh, I love it. Good luck with the lotto. Oh. Is that a reference to... Okay, Washington ran a lot of lottos in his uh, life. Uh, I don't know if he did one when he was president, but actually there's some collector's items that are... Uh, what is the name of that lotto? Hold on. I gotta find this. I gotta find this. Um... The Mountain Road, Mountain Road Lottery, yeah. There's actually some tickets. I don't know if you can see that on here. They sell for a lot of money. I'm trying to, let me, oh here, let me do it this way. How do I do this? I don't know if you can see it. Let me look at the, Oh, you're seeing okay yeah yeah you can see it okay on the left this is number 173 but yeah it's a it's, it's a lotto basically it's a fundraiser for uh, the mountain uh, I'm drawing a blank on the name again how did I not anyway for a mountain road mountain is right there mountain road lottery and it's signed by George Washington they're actually really rare and yeah, it was drawn for a Mountain Road Lottery, which uh, did not go well for Washington. Let's see if it says in here. Uh, anyway, doesn't matter. It didn't work out well. <laughs> it was never completed. British Band All Lotteries, that's what it says. That's what it was. But yeah, so that's uh, another little history lesson tucked into this whole little random video that I made. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching and I look forward to further Hamilton and other reactions. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.